you. Do you need to cut it more or? Yeah. This is just the rough size. What's that gonna do? Um, so when the air goes through the bumper, it doesn't just go in this big cavity here. It gets deflected and goes either around that way or more air gets to go into towards my radiator, which is important. Now that this is cleared, I think, yep, I can go all the way to the ceiling. This needs to get cut more. Right around there. So I go across there. And I feel like... The length is good? Yeah. Oh. So it needs to go all the way across. And then down here is too tall. Oh, that's what I mean. So I need to cut something like that and something like that all the way across. Oh, that's better. That's pretty much it. And I just gotta. What are you gonna use to hold it down? Put some screws and bolts in there. here trim like a little bit off and I'll put some bolt here did I touch it what are you doing I'm trying to mark a dot What are you going to check? Um, I just want to see if this bolt fits and I don't have any, so I got to go buy some. This is perfect. Just some different lengths. And then we can bolt that piece to all these uh, already existing holes. That's it. That was beautiful. Thing. Did you find what you needed? Uh, there's only like 
three of those and two of these, but I might have to just grind it down or something. I'm just gonna drill the holes, the mounting holes. Roughly where they are. Where's your safety going? safety glasses on now but we forgot about those <laughs> yay okay ready to put it on this is pretty much the shape that fits inside of this big opening right here. And I cut it so that it fits nicely in here. Already pre-drilled the holes to use some existing hole locations. Um, so what I'm using is the Kumalu product and they come in different colors. This one came in black and white and my front side is going to be black. And I'm just peeling off the protective cover and I put it in place with the nut and bolts and washers. After this, I'm gonna tighten it down, and then I'll be done. What are you doing? Just tightening these nuts and bolts down. Got some lock nuts, so they shouldn't come back out. So now that it's installed, you can see that the hole that was here is blocked off and any of the high pressure air that flows from in front of the bumper and through it doesn't crash uh, directly flow into the engine bay. You want a negative or low air pressure zone inside the engine bay. So everything flows away from it, around it. It even has this nice little slope. I don't know if it's really going to help, but it goes towards the radiator. And now more of the air is going to flow through this opening and cool this tiny little radiator better than it used to. Um, and then, yeah, and then the next project is gonna be putting a vent here. So with the low pressure zone, um, high pressure is gonna flow over the hood, create a vacuum and suck air out of the engine bay. So hopefully that keeps the engine bay cooler and run more effective and less overheating on the track. Okay. That's it. Thank you.